Hello everyone, myself Yukta Gugloth, Secretary of Applied Forensic Research Sciences. I am here with a new topic that is Types of Cyber Crime, which is written by Mr. Ravi Agarwal, Volunteer of Applied Forensic Research Sciences. Our content includes first, introduction, second, categories of cyber crime, third, types of cyber crime, fourth, some common types of cyber crime, and last we have safety tips from cyber crime. Cybercrime is a criminal activity which is carried out by means of computer by the use of internet is also known as cybercrime or internet crime. People from various geographic areas engages in cybercrime. Cybercrime involves fundamental breaches of personal or cooperative privacy such as assaults on the integrity of information held in digital depositories and the use of illegally obtained digital information to blackmail a firm or individual. Next we have is categories of cybercrime. In this we have three types that is crime against people, property and government. First we have is crime against people and the examples are cyber harassment, stalking, distribution of child pornography, credit card frauds, human trafficking, spoofing, identity theft and online libel or slander. Second is crime against property. In this crime which is occurred against a property are included such as a computer or server and the examples are DDoS attacks, hacking, virus transmission, cyber and typo squatting, computer vandalism, copyright infringement and IPR violations. Third and the last category of cyber crime we have is crime against government. When a cyber crime is committed against the government it is considered as an attack on the nation's sovereignty and the cyber crimes included are hacking, accessing confidential information, cyber warfare, cyber terrorism and pirated software. Our next side heading is types of cyber crime and the cyber crimes are hacking, phishing, cyber stalking, identity theft and invasion of privacy, cyber bullying and harassment, spreading false information or fake news, ATM frauds, virus and worms, ransomware, cyber crime related to finance, email bombing, email spoofing, child pornography, computer vandalism, cyber terrorism, software privacy and copyright violations, counterfeiting and forgery, denial of service attacks, cyber extortion, password trafficking, domain name hijacking, and classified globally security data theft. Next slide heading we have is types of cyber crime. In this we will be learning few common types of cyber crimes like hacking, phishing, child pornography, cyber terrorism, cyber extortion, spreading false information or fake news. First we will be starting with hacking. In common terms, hacking is identifying weakness of a computer system or network to utilize its weakness to gain access to the computer. On the other hand, we have as ethical hacking. That means using computer or internet to commit fraudulent acts such as fraud, privacy invasion, stealing corporate or personal data, etc. Phishing is a type of online scam where criminals imitate or mimic a legal organizations via mail, text message, advertisement or other means in order to steal sensitive information. Third is child pornography. It includes showing a child who is being sexually abused, which is against the law in many countries as well as in India. And it has a very strong law and punishment. Next we have is spreading false information or fake news. Fake news in India refers to misinformation or disinformation in the country which can be through word of mouth or traditional media and nowadays recently through digital forms of communication such as edited videos, memes, unverified advertisement and social media propagated rumors. Next is cyber terrorism. Cyber terrorism is the use of internet to conduct violent acts that result in threatening or loss of life or significantly body harm in order to achieve political or ideological gains through threatening or intimidation. The last we have is cyber extortion. It is an online crime in which hackers hold your data, website, computer systems or other sensitive informations until you meet their demands for payment. It often takes the form of a ransomware. Here are some safety tips from which you can prevent cyber crime. You can use antivirus software, insert firewalls, uninstall unnecessary softwares, maintain backup, check security settings, 
Aware people about cyber crime always check the source of information without opening. Don't open unknown links, emails and messages. Always make alpha numeric passwords which includes alphabets and numbers equally. Keep changing your passwords continuously. Don't share your personal information with anyone such as your passwords or security questions or OTP. Coming to the end of the video, let's check how much you have learned. Question is which one of the following is a computer threat? And the options are DOS attack, phishing, soliciting, and stalking. If you know the answer, mention them in the comment box. The question asked in the previous video on the topic of branches of forensic science is the following option does not come under the branches of forensic science, and the options were forensic biology, forensic toxicology, forensic diatomology, and none of the above. And the correct answer is C, that is forensic diatomology. Thank you. Keep watching.